I've been asked by the eBay seller to explain why I have some problems with this device. It's a DSO 150 digital oscilloscope. This is how it comes straight out of the package. You plug it into a USB port on a PC and plug the probe onto a signal and you get this, which is nothing, just a bright screen. There is no brightness or contrast control on the uh, device. So I turn it over and I see in the top corner there, here, a, a screw adjustment saying LCD. So I'll now adjust that, that and see what happens. Now I've made that adjustment and there is in fact something I can see on the screen which is very hard to show on the, on the um, computer because it is just so faint. Um, this um, phone camera doesn't have much contrast ability, but there it is. You can see down the bottom of the screen there's a, a little waveform, square waveform. Um, th there's some writing on the right hand side that's very blurred. The waveform is not adjustable, you can't move it up or down the screen or change its amplitude because there is no vertical amplifier on this device or attenuator. Um, the waveform I'm using is a one uh, volt peak to peak square wave at one kilohertz coming off the crow uh, calibration point on a proper oscilloscope. I'll show that now. Okay, there you can see a, a real oscilloscope uh, with the calibration point with the probe for one of its channels on it and the other probe is for the DSO-150 so it's looking at exactly the same thing and if it was working properly it would show a square wave like that. Back to the DSO-150 and this is all you can get. You can see how it's very hard to show it because of the um, exposure of the mobile phone camera but there, you can see there is a, a little square wave there at the bottom. You can't synchronize it, there's no synchronizing adjustment you can change the time base and make it wider or narrower. Um, 